Hello, and welcome to a Tabletop Bellhop Cardboard Coat Check. That's a silly name we have for our unboxing series, where we answer the question, what's in the box? So I guess it's the package this time, not really a box. It's kind of square shape. What's in the package today? It's going to be what's in the package. Um, I am Otuzno, the Tabletop Bellhop, your cardboard concierge. Normally answering your game and game night questions and striving to make everyone's gaming experience better. Let me put my years of game playing, event organizing, and game night hosting to use for you. And also, find our podcast, the Tabletop Bellhop Gaming Podcast, on your favorite podcatcher. Or if you prefer some video, you can join us Wednesday nights at 9.30 p.m. Eastern, where we answer your questions live with me and my podcast co-host, Sean. That gets edited down and released on YouTube on Tuesdays. So if you can't make the live show, you can always catch our YouTube videos. They go live 2 a.m. on Tuesdays. So you can watch us, you can read us, or you can listen to us or do all three if you really want to hear us three times a week. Uh, so what I'm doing today is I am unboxing something, something special from Quiver, the people at Quiver Time. Now, in a full disclosure, we worked with Quiver. We did a giveaway with Quiver in the past. And they were our first sponsor for our podcast, which I still appreciate. I thank Quiver for that. Now, they have something new coming out. And they were excited and wanted to get the word out. And they sent me a copy of whatever this is. I have a, I have a good idea what it is, but I don't know for sure. I haven't opened this up. I don't know what it is. Uh, this was sent for free. Um, I'm under no obligation to talk about this. But we had a good re working relationship with them. I really dig the people at Quiver. And I do like their product. The, the Quiver Time Card Curing Case is really nice. Uh, if you go to tabletopbellhop.com, click on reviews, you'll find my review of the Quiver. And I'll just say right here, it's very positive. Really impressed with the case. So I'm looking forward to whatever Quiver has sent me. Something new. So something new from Quiver. And I do apologize for the glare from the white package there. I'll hold it about here so it's not glowing quite as badly. So we're going to take a look at what Quiver sent us. Um, again, I don't know exactly what this is. So we are going to open this up and see what Quiver Time sent us. Sent me. Oh. Oh. Okay. I am going to sneak ahead, pull this out, see if there's anything interesting I need to know before I share this with you guys. Okay, that's just an invoice. I don't know, they might have wrote a letter in here or something. Alright, double check. So here we go. Here is Quiver's new product. And anyone who knows what Quiver Time does, because they make premium card game protection, this just makes sense. Uh, they make some of the best card sleeves on the market. They make one of the best card carrying cases on the market. Well, now they have deck boxes. So we obviously have five different colors. We have a spot to write on them. All come shrink wrapped. This should be how they are sent. There is also something in there. We'll find out what that is. For those of you watching live on Twitch, there is a link to the original review now in our chat room. All right, not only that, each individual one is shrink wrapped. So we have a ton of shrink wrap here to get through. There we go. Starting to rip now. Now, what I really should have did for this video is had a quiver on hand. Because I am certain that these are going to fit inside the quiver card carrying case perfectly. So we're going to open up. I don't think I'm going to open up all five of these. We're going to open up one of these. There's lots of different places to be able to label these. I think is a nice touch. So if you're holding it this way, you can label your box this way. Label that side. Label that side. Has the quiver logo. Okay, I am super glare. There you can kind of see the quiver logo. It says it holds 80 plus cards that should be sleeved. Oh, this is nice. It's solid. It's a uh, nice thick plastic. You know what? The red is not doing good things with the light here. Is green any better? There, green looks like it's going to be better. I'm going to open up the green one. All right, green one. Can you see that a little better? There we go. It's a little better. Uh, there's a QR code on the bottom. Designed and developed in the EU, made in China. It's a nice solid. Solid opening up there. And there is two branded quiver dividers in each of these. So you can put, I don't know, three different decks, separate your health cards from your other cards. I don't play a lot of card games. So there we have five really nice solid plastic um looks like all the ones you can generally get at the store these are very nice quality as far as i can tell i don't play a lot of collectible card games 
it is nice to have everything in one brand. And I got to thank my wife, Deanna, for bringing me this. So here we have a quiver, and we're going to do the important thing here. And here we have a quiver that currently has in it all of my Star Realm stuff. So this is obviously not going to all fit in one card box. What else do we have here? This isn't Star Realms. This should be something separate. So, what do I have here? These should fit sleeved or unsleeved cards. Okay, these are actually for Ag Agricola. So Agricola cards, we're gonna toss them in here. There's definitely room for sleeved cards. So here's unsleeved cards in the card box. Wow, the light. I apologize. Let's try that. Sorry for the bad sound. There we go. Now we're not getting nearly as much reflection. And sure enough, look at that. That fits pretty much perfectly. That is exactly what I expected to see, but good to know. Ta-da. Oh, <laughs> Star Realms instructions falling everywhere. So, like any of the Quiver products, you can mix and match. We're going to slide that down and see if I can put one more of these in here. So there you go, there's three of the five fitting in the quiver. I could obviously fit two more, as well as have some other room. I dig it. I gotta decide exactly what I'm gonna do with it. Seals up nicely, fits in good. So, the folk at quiver time, that's quivertime.com. Now, in addition to having one of the best card cases, carrying cases on the market, and some really nice card sleeves now have deck boxes as well. So not much more I can say about that. Um, I could probably fit two to three Keyforge decks in here, which is probably what I'm going to use these for. So there's two dividers. I'll be able to fit in three Keyforge decks in one of these. And then I can label it Keyforge, which will be a little nicer. because I wouldn't have to do what I just had to do and pull the cards out and go, oh, these are Agricola cards. I'll know right from the box. Um, solid plastic, like I'm squeezing them. They're not going to break or bend easy anyway. Um, come individually shrink wrapped. You get five different colors. Looks cool. Uh, good work. Quiver, who I need to show this to is some magic players that I know. They'd probably be a lot more excited than I am. But now you get a first look. These are not even on the market yet. So here's your first look at Quiver deck boxes from Quiver Time. So for Tabletop Bellhop, I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop. Before you go, be sure to hit that subscribe button or follow button, depending on what platform you're on. Um, make sure to check out the website, tabletopbellhop.com. You can always send questions to questions at tabletopbellhop.com. I did mention that Quiver Time was a sponsor. I am more than willing to work with other publishers as a sponsorship. You can send an email to mo at tabletopbellhop.com if that's something you'd be interested in. Speaking of promotion, it'd be cool if you went over to patreon.com forward slash tabletopbellhop and took a look at our Patreon account because it helps support what I'm doing right here and what we do on the blog and what we do on the website. Ah, uh, for Tabletop Bellhop, I am Mo Tuzano. Good night and game on.